just do that. I don't like looking into the sun. <laughs> Unattractive way possible. Yeah, but you're glowing. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Good, and y'all? Very good. Very cool. You think this is a good place to take a picture, huh? Uh, your name is Wanda? <laughs> take a look right over. Wanda does. Show her. Nice. Here's what I usually do. I say, have you seen our barbecue aprons? I sell more of these than I do t-shirts when I have them in stock. But they're very handy. They have a towel to wipe your hands on when you're barbecuing. <laughs> <laughs> this place is like... My Graceland. This feels very Stanhopean, doesn't it? Downstairs, the showroom, it feels like just fucking beers being thrown at people and just like an okay corral. This is. Should like get crazy to the. <laughs> it is funny, the amount of people that I've been like, yo, how do you, you know, what do, you, what do I do while I'm here? And they're like, leave, dude. <laughs> They're like, get the fuck out of here. And I'm like, well, I'd like to see nature. They're like, well, I guess you could rent a car, drive 45 miles out to the mountain, idle it right outside the forest, walk in there with no knowledge about wildlife whatsoever, and just kind of take a fucking picture of the first moose slash cougar you run into. I'm like, oh, this is going to be exciting. It's exciting stuff. I went to the zoo today, the Alaska Zoo, which, yeah, that's, that's a pretty sweet somebody's backyard. That is just somebody's gravel driveway. <laughs> and they just put pit stops of animals. Yes. They didn't even try. It was like a, it's like dog kennels. It's like they just dropped a crate on top of a fucking coyote. And I think it's like, <laughs> It has been very nice though. So many people have told me how beautiful it's gonna be here in two weeks. <laughs> So super excited to not be here for that. They're like, oh man, you caught the tail end of the nightmare season. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. That's what I love about Alaska. It's almost like Detroit with a Bob Ross painting behind it. <laughs> it's like this crazy city and then beautiful. It doesn't look like it's a part of the same reality. It's insane. You're just left, like hop skipping and weaving in and out of dangerous homeless. <laughs> And then I see just this unbelievable mountainscape behind it. I'm like, if I could only run three miles to the base of that mountain. I don't know, it's like the four hours. That's what it is. I, I flew here from New York. I took 46 planes to get here. I don't know if you guys know, but there is an Alaska Airlines strike happening right now. So I found out I may need to work here forever. <laughs> which is pretty exciting. I find out tomorrow if I get to go home tomorrow. <laughs> so, fingies crossed for the kid. <laughs> love the shirt! Love the shirt, hell yeah, dude. I love fucking wolves and Alaska. Yes. Yeah, man. Exactly. Are you a wolf guy? Woo! <laughs> <laughs> that was like the, that was the most party animal shit I've ever heard in my entire life. There's not a doubt about it that you've done a key bump and head butted somebody in the exact same movement. That's like a black belt in black and house. Just a And you didn't even spill the bag. Two hours later. Oh, we just have tours around here. Oh, I mean, like, you gotta, I mean, if you're really into Russian stuff, you get a lot of Russians here. And by the way, I dare Putin to take back Alaska. Here, kitty, kitty. <laughs> is this our TT Jerry? <laughs> this is a cool hang, cool hang spot. Who's smoking the dope? <laughs> Me. Where have you been here? We have been to the zoo, the it? one with cages. Oh. Okay. And the oh, gravel well, road. Well, the uh, how long? They had a tiger. Hey. Oh, oh, okay. Then definitely the zoo, because we don't have tigers in conservation. Yeah, yeah. Cause you know why? Tigers don't live here. Yeah, that's right. They sure don't. We used to have a. Uh, we had elephants, we trained them so well, and this is kind of sad. We made them paint. I have a t-shirt painted by her. No shit! Shut that up! Was he, that was yeah. here? That, that yes! Was, that was here. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, it was like uh, right before <coughs> Binky, <coughs> when Binky, you know, Oh, yeah, that that's bitch. right. Binky. Oh, uh, is it? <laughs> <laughs> You're like, you know, Binky. Come on, dude, whatever. 
<laughs> no, there's a bear, and you know, it, it, there's a little thing that goes, don't, don't cross over. Uh huh. And this bitch crossed over. And it goes, well, don't, don't go here. And she went there. She went to Binky, and Binky was like, I'm in a cage, bitch. And she snapped, grabbed her leg, and the thing is, the picture is, he, Binky's got the shoe. You know, you see those little wood things that said don't cross? Yeah. Okay, well, she went yeah, across it. And then there's another cross that goes, don't cross this either. And then she so crossed it. <laughs> just in case you crossed you, you, the first you, you, one. And they put it, and they put it in different languages one. and cram yeah. or something, you know? Really and then, <laughs> no, no, keep you. And there's a fence. And she's on, oh, good now. She's on the fence. And Mickey's like, here, kitty. kitty. She died? No. no. She had a scrape on her leg and she was upset and wanted to sue. We're like, bitch, did you not see the sign? Two signs. Five. Yeah. Three. Three. <laughs> I think this is the one. <coughs> I think we're going to keep by the. <laughs> 12 seconds later. Alright, let's go cut my panties off. That might be the end of the night. <laughs> like, I might cut them off and be like, I have to go home. Yeah. So Birdhouse was a bar on Turnigan Arm where people stop in, drop their undergarments, whatever they might be, and the fact of the matter is it burnt down some years ago. So Coots brought up this birdhouse, in a sense, for people to drop their undergarments, whether it be a bra or underwear, and initial them for the most part, and hang them up from the frickin' ceiling or wallpaper, whatever. So the birdhouse, the original birdhouse, birdhouse, was on Turnigan, and so tr people traveling, whatever, first time to Alaska, Alaskan residents, whatever, hooked their uh, undergarments on the ceiling, the wall, whatever, and move on. So it's kind of a tradition, so Coots continued that tradition after the birdhouse, the original birdhouse, burnt down and ended up being where people lose their undergarment. It's just kind of a nice tradition. My 
asshole is looking at these guys right now. One pair of pants later. His britches are in the birdhouse. His britches? Wanda That's got right. him to leave a little DNA behind. She got you with the big D. She got no, no, she there wasn't nothing big about it. <laughs> Our flight got canceled, because why wouldn't it? Whoa.